for communities of practice. We learned that what they were and why they were used. We later had to revisit Captivate and create a project about COPs. The first emergent tool we researched was ProtoPage. This page is, great, is a great tool and helps you keep your life in order. The only problem is I would just have to remember to use it. The next tool I researched was AppMaker. It's an excellent and simple tool that leads you step by step in making your own app. AudioSana was a tool I explored that you could use to create music. It's possibly a great tool to use for someone with prior knowledge in using the soundboard. The tool I had the most fun with was Until AM. It's a DJ app that uses turntables and mixers and could actually be used for an event. I think it would be excellent for a beginner DJ. The assignment I had the most fun learning to use was Second Life. Second Life was my first experience with DW when using Avatar Interaction. I'm not a gamer, so at first I must admit I didn't like it. Then after I got in and learned how to maneuver a little, it got, it got better. But what really made me enjoy it was when I learned how to alter my appearance at will and learning how to shop. I ended up with over 3,000 items in my inventory. That changed the game for me and made my experience in Second Life more enjoyable. I enjoyed this month's journey with my classmates and we had some real interaction. I look forward to what's ahead and I can't wait to continue to work with my classmates on this journey.